Of all the speeches delivered in American history, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr.'s I Have a Dream speech is arguably the most iconic. Over a half century later, it still means so much to so many out there. Tampa Bay residents who were there to hear it, they'll never forget it. 10 Tampa Bay reporter Bobby Lewis is on the road with a look back at those that were there at the historic march on Washington. Free at last, thank God Almighty, we are free at last. Some days prove so powerful, history cannot ignore them. August 28th, 1963 was such a day. The march was not a black thing and it was not a white thing. It was a people thing. 57 years ago, over 200,000 people participated in the March on Washington for jobs and freedom, including many who wound up in Tampa Bay. I will never forget it, and I was glad I was there. It was just the most spiritual experience I ever had. The Hillsborough County Public Library gathered their testimonies on the 50-year anniversary of the historic march. Martin Luther King was up there. Preserving those memories I on YouTube. I, I went because they were, it was a march on Washington, and uh, they were going to be peaceful and so forth, so I went. We could see everything because Martin Luther King was on a raised platform. Their words and, offer a window into the past so everything... and feelings still alive in the present. That my four little children will one day live in a nation where they will not be judged by the color of their skin, but by the content of their character. I have a dream today. And you felt like, you, I mean, you were just, you didn't feel like you were walking. Just everybody so focused on the one same thing. It was just a moment that in your life when you were there, you would never forget because it was, it was the stamp of history was being emblazoned on your very soul. 